Good morning, dear students. I have an important appointment today. I can't teach. Another teacher will teach. Her name is Mrs. Schneider. She is very nice. You're going to love them. I have to go now. Hello, dear students. My name is Mrs. Schneider. I am the substitute teacher for Mr. Coons. I am teaching today. I take work very seriously. You have a lot to learn. This is the only way you can get a good job. That's why we're writing a test now. What? We're writing a test. Yes, a test over the last hour. But I wasn't there. Have you repeated the material? No, not yet. But you must. I'll do it right now. You can do that. We'll write the test anyway. Please don't. I can't get another six. You've got 300 minutes. The time starts now. The time is over. Please submit the test now. Here is my test, Mrs. Schneider. But you didn't write anything. I wasn't here in the last hour. I couldn't write anything. Then I'll have to give you a six. What, a six? Not again. What's up, Lisa? Why are you crying? I got a six at school today. Another six? How did that happen? We wrote an unannounced test. I wasn't here in the last hour. And Mr. Coons still gave you a six? No, it was Mrs. Schneider. I'll talk to her. Hello, Schneider here. Hello, Mrs. Schneider. This is Mr. Peters. I'm Lisa's father. How can I help you, Mr. Peters? Lisa told me what happened today. They gave her a six. She deserves that too. I'd like to talk to you in person. You can come to my office. I'll be there in 10 minutes. That's enough now. I'm going to have a serious word with Mrs. Schneider. Lisa can't get another six. 
This is Lisa's school. I'm going to Mrs. Schneider's office. Hello, Mrs. Schneider. Hello, Mr. Peters. I'm glad you're here. I'll get straight to the point. Gladly. Why did you just give Lisa a six? Because she turned in a blank sheet of paper. She wasn't here in the last hour. It doesn't matter to me. She must repeat the fabric. Don't you think that's a bit harsh? It's the only way Lisa learns discipline. They're far too nice. It's not good for Lisa. If you don't teach discipline, then I will. Why is Mr. Coons gone? A. It's his birthday. B. He has a new job. C. He has an appointment. Write a comment.